that we need to be doing. Now, creating something someone wants to buy is because it solves a problem or meets a need that they have. Regardless of anything else, they have a need. Even if their need is, for example, this proves the creativity out there. People do not want the same old, same old. Unique gifts for your boss, search 2,500 times a month that exact phrase. Unique gifts for my boss or for a boss. Bots only know how to connect information that's already there. But as humans, we can create, sort, and deduct from our own reasoning these specific things. People are looking for unique and different and creative and quirky. Look up those words on Merchant Words or whatever keyword software you're using. I hope it's Merchant Words. Mommyincome.com slash Merchant Words is the absolute best in my opinion. I love it. It's easy. It's easy to just literally do a 30-second search and get your information that you need. And understanding all that, it's not just about bots and software. You're going to have to think. You're going to have to create. You're going to have to use your brain to think about these things. Bots can help, certainly. Software can help us at least narrow down some ideas. But the who, what, when, where, why, and how of a product or a bundle is essential. Who is it for? What are they going to use it for? What need does it meet or problem does it solve for them? For example, going back to unique gifts for your boss. Like nobody wants the same old, same old, right? I mean, it's like you want to be the one that's giving the gift that's like epic, right? And so this is what people are searching for. They want unique and different gifts. They don't want the same old, you know, whatever that people are giving. So I'm always thinking about the gift market. Why? Because there's gifts for every single thing. 